Staying in Nigeria, the government has sought partnership with the International Labour Organization to join its fight against poverty and child labour. Nigeria's Minister of Labour and Employment, Dr. Chris Ngige, made this call in the nation's capital, Abuja, when he received an audience the French candidate vying for the position of the Director General of the International Labour Organization. Ngige says there is a need for ILO to help develop strategies that will support the creation of jobs in low- and middle-income countries worldwide. What are the causes of child labour? Everything is uh, attached to income. Income. Low income has pushed parents and families to put out their children into the farms, into the mines, into the uh, hawking in the streets. So, low income begins also poverty. So ILO has to join in fighting poverty. And in joining to fight poverty, or, uh, you cannot eliminate poverty. But we must do a poverty reduction system and put it in place. Between generation, child labor has increased. Back, the uh, situation of young girls is, uh, has, uh, is going back to. And uh, of course, a huge question of youth future. Uh, youth is probably one of the main assets, uh, huge potential of development for Africa. Uh, I mean, when we say, we all agree that Africa is the future of the world, and especially Nigeria being the leading country in Africa, is because this youth is a huge asset. If they can access to education, to jobs, uh, to entrepreneurship, uh, it's a huge asset for the future. And we need also um, to work at the ILO to envision and to prepare to accompany governments and social partners.